is this place? Why can't she just realize that I'm not supposed to be trapped here? Like, the basement? What is this? Oh, why, oh, why can't Princess Verena just, just find it in her heart to just let me go? I don't know why she's doing this. All I've ever wanted was just to be with my family. And that's it. And all of a sudden, here I am. <sighs> I just wish I could get out of here somehow. I don't know how, though. Like, I mean, I'm, I've read all most of these books already. And I'm really hungry and there's nothing here. All I've got is my bed and I'm not too tired. So I don't want to go to bed. And I've only got a chair and a table. Hmm. Oh, no. I think I hear her calling me. Oh, dear. I'm so happy I managed to kidnap you. You'll never leave, and then you'll be my prisoner for the rest of your life. I see what you see around here, all these cats and dogs. They're gonna be staying with you. And definitely trapped, and you'll never ever see your parents. And guess what? None of your friends too, I can promise you that. But why, Princess Verna? Why are you being so mean to me? Like, I don't deserve this. Why, Cassie? <laughs> you ask me why? How dare you? Well, I'm gonna tell you. I am mean, and I like to be mean. As evil as anyone can get to, that's what I want to be. If I like to keep things that belong to me, I keep them. Like you, Cassie, you belong to me. So don't even think about ever leaving this castle, ever. Princess Verna, you have to realize that this what you're doing is not true and what you're doing to me right now is completely crazy you kidnapped me from my parents house for no reason at all at all my parents i love my parents my friends i'm so far away from my friends i don't know even know where i am right now oh well cassie to be honest i've really had enough talking with you guards take cassie to the basement now I wish I could seriously get out of here sometimes. I just hate this. I'm just not doing anything. I'm just, I miss everyone so much. And then I'm just, <sighs> why can't she just realize I shouldn't be here? Like, why, honestly? <sighs> I guess, I'm, plus I'm so hungry. I'm actually starving. Like, I mean, how could she literally live me here without any food, water, anything? Okay, I'm gonna actually ask one of the guards if it's possible for me to go get some food or maybe he can sneak me some food. I don't know if he'll do that though because he's always on Cassie's side. Oh, oh my god, what should I do? What should I do? But I am going to die of starvation. Okay, here. Yeah, right, okay, I'll tell you what I do. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna climb these stairs and go ask the guard because, I mean, he has to realize I haven't eaten all day at all. Hi, guard. Um, I just wanted to know whether if it's possible if you could 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 be able to get some food. I'm I'm just really 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 hungry. I'm gonna pass out. Please, please, please help me. Well, Cassie, it's orders from the princess that we're not allowed to obliged to give you any food or drink unless told by Princess Verna. I am really sorry. I don't know why she constantly keeps you trapped, but honestly, I can't help you, unfortunately. Oh, okay. Well, I must be off then. Back down to that place over there. Well, I guess I have no choice then. Hmm. Seeing as the guard won't give me any food, I might just take this book and just eat it. No, 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 Cassie, no, you can't do that. That's, that's not real. You can't do that. You can't just eat a book because you're so hungry. Oh, but it hurts. No, 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 I'll tell you what you can do. You can maybe count the red blocks on the floor? Maybe? No, 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 if you were done, done that. Maybe the black ones? No, 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 sure, you're going to go crazy. Um, let me see. Um, I don't want to sit on this chair again. Oh, might as well. Is it even bright outside? 
I don't even know anymore. Maybe I'll just... Maybe, but you know what I'll do? Maybe I'll just go to bed and then, and then in the morning, and then in the morning I can definitely go and get some food from the kitchen because I know I can eat so much there. I know she'll be able to let me eat so much there because I only have... In the morning she lets me do that. Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. I'll definitely go to sleep now. Okay. Need to do this. Ooh, ooh. What was that noise? Oh, go. Oh, no. I'm just awake. That's good. Oh, but I'm so hungry though. It's a good thing though. That was the noise at the door, which means it's unlocked. So what I'll do is I'll just drop this book here. Don't want to bring it outside upstairs with me. And then I'll have to be really, really quiet though. Let me see. Hi. Ooh. Oh look, there's my puppy. Hello, Ken. Ken, come back. Oh, oh well. Hi, Steve. Hi, Glenn. Okay, I'll just be really, really quiet to go, just in case that she's asleep. And I will constantly go slowly back to the kitchen. And let me see. Hi, Rob. Hi Tom, morning, and look, I can't wait to get you guys off. Oh, hi Chef Bob, hi Bob, how are you? Good morning, I am so, so happy I get to eat some breakfast. I'm so hungry, Princess Verena didn't let me eat at all yesterday, so I'm so hungry. What have you got? For me today. Good morning, Cassie. How are you today? Well, since seeing as Princess Verna is still a slave, what I can do is whip something up real special. Seeing as she's not around for another few hours, you can be here all the time eating if you wanted to. Don't worry, I won't say a thing. Thank you so much, Chef Bob. Oh, look at this. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, is that a cheeseburger? Cheeseburger. Hmm. Mm, what is this as well? Bacon. And I'm going to eat a burger as well. Delish. Oh my gosh. Oh, yummy. Thank you so much, Chef Bob. But what I'm going to do now is I'll probably try something and go for a walk outside. Hopefully, if Princess Verna is still obviously still asleep, I may be able to go outside. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good day. Now, let me see. Oh, I don't know. Is it raining outside? Maybe I'll go for a walk outside. Or... I don't know, what should I do? Hmm, as long as I can just keep going, or maybe I could just quickly go watch some TV for a few minutes just before she actually comes in. It wouldn't be so bad, I guess. I mean, I'm stuck in my room all the time in the basement. I mean, there's nothing else for me to do. Maybe I'll just quickly turn on the TV. Ooh, I quite like this show. Ooh, uh oh, oh no. I'm so full right now that I might actually fall asleep. Oh. Oh, oh, that was a nice, nice nap. Oh, I shouldn't have actually just napped, seeing as I was just finished eating, but sure. Look at, I've watched my good TV. Gotta turn it off. Uh-oh, I think I hear her. Oh, oh, now to go check it out. Hello, everyone. Oh, I feel so amazing after that. Hi, guys, how are you? Oh, Hi, Princess Verena. I heard you looking. You were looking for me. Hi. Cassie, where were you? Huh? I've been looking for you for twenty minutes. The guards haven't seen you. Where were you? Tell me now. Um. I was, um, because I was finished eating in the morning, I, 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 um, decided to go and sit and watch some TV, but I accidentally fell asleep, and I'm really, really sorry, I'm really, 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 really sorry. You were doing what? Since when have I ever allowed you to watch TV, huh? Huh? Now, Cassie, you see? This is why I shouldn't let you be roaming around the castle grounds by yourself. And do you know why? Because I've lost my dancing shoes. Have you seen them? 
Have you? Huh? Huh? Honestly, you're the only person that has access to any parts of this kingdom. It's only my guards that are around. Seriously, you must have taken them. Princess Verna, I swear it wasn't me. I swear. I promise it wasn't me. I've been asleep after watching the TV because I was so full after eating. <laughs> Cassie, come on. Stop lying to me. Of course I know it was you. Who else would be wanting my dancing shoes? No one else but you. The guards would definitely not have done this. And you are the only thing that I know would do this to me. Why could you? Why? Why? Honestly, Princess Verna, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never touched them. I've never touched your dancing shoes before. I honestly didn't do it. <sighs> honestly, Cassie, do you really think I would believe you? This is the last straw. Never, ever, ever are you allowed to walk around the castle grounds. Guards, lock her back in the basement. <sighs> Princess Verna, please don't do this. Please, please. I swear it wasn't me. I swear it wasn't me. Uh, uh. I guess that's it. It wasn't me, but yet she had to blame me for doing this. I don't know why she had to do this. Oh, this isn't fair at all. I wish, I wish someone would really come and save me, really. All I do here is just walk around and it's just really unfair. This can't be happening to me again. I just can't be locked in here forever. Who can come and save me, seriously? that Cassie is trapped in my basement forever. This is such great news. The guards have locked her up for good and this is something I've always wanted. I wonder what animal I can think of to trap in my basement with her. Hmm, or maybe get the guards to build another basement section so I can get another animal in there. Hmm, I guess that's true. I guess that could be interesting. Anyways, I must have to see how Drake is doing. Ooh, Drake, I'm coming for you. My little pet, how are you today? I saw that the guards got you some birds today for dinner. I hope you enjoyed eating them. Oh yes, I can see all the empty cages down there. Oh yes, good boy, you've eaten them all. Oh, I'm just so excited. I can't wait until I let you out and we can have some fun times together. Also, I was talking to Cassie earlier and I know she is so scared of you. And you know that we can go and scare her some time if she's misbehaving. Um, well, look at the time, Drake. I must be off and going, torturing some more animals. I'll come back to you later and make sure that the guards have fed you again. Good boy. See you later. Oh, hi. Hi, hi Princess Verna. Um, what are, you, what are you doing here? Um... What am I doing here? It's my castle. Of course I'm allowed to be whatever I want to be. And just so you know, Cassie, you're going to be trapped here for such a long time and no one's going to be able to save you. I hope you realise this. Miss Verna, I don't know how you can be so horrible. I seriously can't believe this. You know that. I know this is your castle grounds and everything like that. But at the end of the day, you can't treat people like this. Honestly, you can't do that. I can do whatever I want to, Cassie. You can't stop me. I have the power, and even my parents tried to control that, I turned them into worms. Did you know that? Now they're roaming free in the kingdom grounds, and nobody can stop me from being this evil. Miss Verna, one day, this kingdom will no longer be ruled by you if you keep being mean to everyone. Your parents into worms? Why? I mean, they, they like, they give, they've given you everything. How could you do that? I'm stuck here in the basement, and I miss them every single day, and you took them away from me. You took them. 
so you have no right to talk to me like that. That is for me to decide whatever I want to do in my life. I hope you enjoy another night of no food or water. Guards, lock the iron doors. I haven't done anything. Oh. What should I do? What guys? Guys, tell me. Tell me. Um, um, maybe I should try and like dig through this. Oh. No, it's not working. Oh, oh. And there were worms. Her parents into worms. Why would she turn her parents into worms? What did they ever do to her but give us this fabulous castle? Oh, okay, 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 Cassie, calm down, calm down. Um, um, just breathe, breathe. Um, okay, okay, no. Whew, okay, okay. Now, what you need to do is you just need to just take a look around again and see if there's anything that you can try and escape. Hmm. No. Okay. No. It's not working. Okay. Okay. Someone needs to tell me or someone can someone. Please just help me. Please help me. Honestly, I don't know what to do. I mean, being here forever, what will I do? I mean, these four walls and these books, I've read them over and over again. I can't keep doing this. <sighs> oh, okay. 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 Seeing as I won't have any food or water, I guess there's nothing else but to just sleep, I guess. I guess so. Oh. <laughs> What's going on? What? Who are you? Where, how, how did you get in? Cassie, we and the other fairies have been watching you very closely and have seen how, how mistreated you have been. We know you don't deserve this from your good heart. So we were sent in from the fairy committee in this kingdom. We have great news. We have a very special gift for you, Cassie. We know that you have been a good cat, and when times get rough and tough, we want to give you this magical collar for you to use. This will allow you to travel in time wherever you would like to go. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, thank you, thank you so much, thank you so much, wise fairy. This is, this is amazing. I get to go wherever I want to go. I don't have to be stuck here anymore. But, 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 what about Princess Verna? D does she know about this? Oh no, Princess Verna doesn't know about this at all. It is best to keep this safe between you and us, just in case the guards come after you and try to take it away. Oh, yes. Okay, okay, yes, okay. So Princess Serena doesn't know about this? Okay, okay, I could, I'll, I'll definitely keep it to myself. I'll, thank you, oh, so much, Wise Fairy. Oh, thank you so much. You don't know what you've done. You've, you've literally given me the best news in this entire world. Thank you, really, thank you. Oh, you are very welcome, Cassie. Now do as you please, and we will be watching you wherever you go, just to keep you safe. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Wise Fairy. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate this. I don't even know what to say. Oh, thank you. Oh, perfect. We are delighted that you are so happy. Be careful of the color, though, Cassie. It comes with great power and great responsibility. Great power and responsibility? Oh, okay, I'll definitely be sure to take care of this color. Definitely. I'll, oh, I'm just so happy. Thank you so much, Fairy. Thank you. Be safe, my little one. I will be sure to check in on you sometime. I must go now, Cassie. Good luck. Gosh, oh, look at my fantastic new collar. Oh, I look so amazing. <gasps> Thank you so much, Wise Fairy. Oh, this is fantastic. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'll, I'll need to have to keep this safe so that Princess Verna doesn't find it. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll, I'll take it off now and, and then I'll put it in a safe place. Ooh, that was an amazing sleep. Thank God. Gosh, I put the lovely collar under my bed so Princess Verna doesn't get to it. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Good morning. Good morning, room. Good morning, chair. Good morning, table. Yes, perfect. Oh, hold on a minute. Is that Princess Verna calling me? Hmm, I wonder what she wants. Good 
morning, Princess Verna. You you were calling me. What what's wrong? Well, Cassie, you seem to be in a chirpier mood. Well, this will bring you back down. Well, I've got something exciting planned for you today. You'll be going outside and catching all the birds for Drake. Oh. Uh. Okay. That that doesn't sound so bad. I guess. W- when would you like me to do that for you? <laughs> Not so bad, Cassie. What has gotten into you? You do realize this place is going to be your home for the rest of your life. I want you to do it right now. Oh my gosh, will she ever learn not to tell me to do all these things for her? Do this, Cassie. Do, do this, Cassie. Oh, hi, Peter. Hi, cutie. Hi, you're so cute. Look at you. Oh my gosh, I just want you to just... Oh, Peter, you not going to say hi to me? Oh, hi. Oh, look. There's Sam. Hi, Sam. Sam, you okay? How's your day? Oh, you're so... Cu- oh, oh. <gasps> Oh my gosh, is that... Is that Samuel the second? Oh, well, okay, he's gone now. Oh my gosh, I have to go catch the birds now for Drake. Oh, let's see if the door will open. Oh, hello. Oh, hello, beautiful day. Now, let's get some food for Dr- Drake. Okay, now I've got all the birds. Okay, I better go back in and go feed go feed them now. Go feed Drake, let's go find him. Drake, you poor thing. Look at you there. There's no reason for Princess Verna to keep you trapped in here. I know you actually have a very, very, very good heart. And you don't deserve to be trapped down here. This is crazy. This is ridiculous. Oh, did you eat all the birds? I gave you all the birds. I know, I know it's probably not a good idea to give you live birds to eat. But, I mean, this is the only thing I can give you to eat. Oh, Drake, Drake, Drake. Oh, the poor little thing. Don't worry. What I have is I've gotten this magical collar from the wise fairy. And what I can do is once I set free from this evil place, I can come back and save you. I promise. I promise, Drake. I'll do that. I'll do that. But but you know what? I, I actually have to go because because she's going to be worried why, why I'm here. Um, I'll, I'll talk to you later, Drake. Bye. Bye bye. Mm. I'm actually kind of quite peckish. Mm. Hello, Chef Bab. How are you? I hope you're well. I'm quite, quite peckish, I think. If you got any surprise for me, just in case that Princess Verna doesn't see me. All right, Cassie, I've whipped you something up real special and quick and tasty. Take a look to your left and say what you think. Oh, thank you, Chef Bob. Oh, what do we have here on my... L- oh! Is that what I think it is? Is that a chocolate donut? Okay, this is delicious. Yum, 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 yum. Delish, delish, delish. Oh, hey, little fella. Okay, thank you. Thanks again. I'll come back to you later, I guess. Mm, what else is there? Come on, guys. Let's go. Let's go back, I guess. Go back to the basement. Or maybe I could sneak over to check out what's on the TV. Okay, let's go slowly, slowly, creeping. Hopefully she doesn't see me. Let's see here now. Oh, hello. The couch, perfect. What's on the TV? Oh, it's, I love this show. This is a very good show. Okay, lovely. Okay, I'm gonna sit here, watch the show. Oh, I'm a little bit tired again. Oh. Maybe I'll just take a little bit. Oh. Oh my gosh. 
Oh, Gussie, you can't nap now. No, 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 not yet. You have to feed the cats and dogs because they haven't been eaten for ages. And I know that Princess Verna won't won't actually have the time or do to feed the cats and dogs. Okay. Okay, coming. Hmm. Where's the kitchen? Hi, Chef Bob. How are you? Completely forgot. I had to had to go and feed the cats and dogs. Is there anything that you can give me so I can give it to them? Any chance that you could do that for me, please? All right, Cassie, you're back for more food. Oh, I'm only joking. Of course, I've leaving you some cupcakes you can give to the cats and dogs. And I know the Princess Verna won't know about this at all. Don't worry about it. Off you go. Oh my gosh, thank you, Chef Bob. Okay, I've got a chocolate cupcake, I've got a cupcake, and I've got a strawberry cupcake. Okay, wait until I see these puppies and cats and dogs and see where I can just give... Oh, hello there, little guy. Come here, back to me. Don't go into the kitchen. I'll give you something if you want to. Here you go. Here's a chocolate cupcake. Now, cupcake number two. You will want it. We that? Oh, hello there, little guy. Hey, Sam. Okay, here you go. I don't know if you'll eat it, but here. And again. Hi, Peter. Hey, Peter. Come back. Peter. Here. Peter. Peter. Here, little guy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here. 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 I've got a strawberry. Do you not want a strawberry cupcake? Come on. Come on. Here. Here. Stop it. Hello. Fine. Here. Hello, do you not want it? Oh, come on, guys. Just take it. Okay, fine. Okay, I'm just going to quickly. I wonder if Princess Fern is over there. Oh, she is. Okay, okay. Um, What do I do? What do I do? Um, um, Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll just go over to her and say hi. Hi, hello, Princess Verna. Hi, sorry. Um, I was just um, I was finished feeding Jake, and um, and he he's very full. So so um, I'm 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 back here now. Well, Cassie, if you have fed Drake, that's fine. But what I need you to do now is go straight back into the basement. Guards, lock her back in. gosh okay well at least the guards blocked me down here um mm, i don't know all oh, right yes the collar is underneath the bed i completely forgot okay um i guess i i could i could take it out and put it on and and, and see what it's like and then maybe i'll i'll it'll work wait once i put the collar on i get to go visit my parents go see my friends oh, oh my gosh i just miss my mom and dad so much i wonder what they're up to i really do i've been down here for so long that i don't even know what they'd be up to hmm. i don't know should i go to bed now maybe and then it's another day or should i just or should i just get this collar on and then maybe I could I could go and visit them finally again okay maybe maybe I should maybe I should oh now that Cassie's back in the basement this is the perfect time for me to decide what I can do to punish her hmm let me think oh maybe one of the guards could take her bed away so she has to sleep on the floor Hmm. Oh yes, that's a great idea. Or maybe I can also take away her table too, so she can't read the books on it. Oh yes. Oh my gosh, I can even then move her into the basement with Drake, so she definitely won't be able to sleep ever. Oh Verna, oh you such you have such great plans, you really do. How do you come up with these ideas by yourself? Hmm. Oh, I also might need to ask the guards to go find my parents in the backyard. And, oh. I need to catch up them into a bucket. That's my plan. Hi everyone, I hope you enjoyed my first ever video. Keep watching for the next episode where you see where I end up after I put my collar on. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also please give a like and a comment on the video. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Also, check out Lil Ali's channel, Lil Carly's channel, Lil Kelly's channel and the rest of the Lil Club channels. And don't forget to subscribe for their adventures. See you later guys.